Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to set up and configure a strong Wi-Fi network for your home using your GeoSIM. We all know about Geo's affordable 4G data plans and are probably using it on our mobile phones or through separate mobile hotspot devices. But the problem is that the hotspot or the mobile device might not give you a strong signal in your entire house and because of this you might be experiencing weaker signals when using internet from another room. To deal with this problem I personally use the Tenda N300 wireless router. The cool thing about it is that it has a USB input port to connect to your hotspot or mobile device. Apart from that it's pretty much like any other ordinary router. It has a power outlet reset buttons and LAN and WAN ports. So I'm just going to quickly reset the router and show you how to configure it from scratch so that you can connect it to your mobile device or hotspot using the USB input and enjoy a strong network signal throughout your house. Okay guys so now I'm going to show you how to configure your router. When you remove the router out of your box you should be able to see a Wi-Fi network starting with tenda underscore and it will be having some number. So if you want to connect, yeah, so uh, to configure the router for the first time you will have to connect to this uh, Wi-Fi network. So I'm going to click on tenda. It doesn't ask you for a password or anything to connect to this network because it is uh, out of the box and it, it wants you to configure the router. So now I'm just going to open up some browser and to configure the router I need to type in this IP address. It's 192.168.0.1. Yeah, so it brings me to the uh, configuration login page. So the default username and the default password is admin. So that's what I'm entering. Admin is already entered for me and the default password when I take the uh, take out the router out of the box is going to be admin so I press admin and I do login so now we are in the configuration page from here you can do a lot of stuff with the router you know I recommend just going through the manual and reading through all of the options but for the purpose of this video we just need to go to the wizard tab um, because we want to use it with a hotspot uh, device and we are going to be supplying the internet through the USB connection so for that we need to select 3G 4G router mode um, you can also use this router as a universal repeater uh, or if you are going to connect to it using an ethernet cable then you can use the wireless router mode but uh, because we are using the USB and uh, you know we are going to be selecting the 3G 4G router mode option you also have certain advanced features where if you want to switch between the 3G, 4G priority and the Ethernet priority but we are not going to get into those details. So I've just uh, unchecked auto switch system mode and I've selected uh, the 3G, 4G router mode and I click next. So because you are using a 4G connection in India, you, uh, you, know, you would want to select India. select India and click next. Um, earlier you saw that we connected to the Tenda network but now we are getting a chance to rename the network that we want so I'm just going to give it the name GeoTest and the key is basically the password so again I'm going to put in a very simple password and I would leave a channel on auto uh, let the router select which channel it wants to use. So after I've entered this information I'll click next and that's it it's a very simple procedure you click finish so this will uh, actually cause your router to restart and reboot and um, after it has restarted and if you have connected um, uh, your mobile hotspot device to the router you should be able to use uh, the 4G network connection um, you know uh, if you place this router somewhere in the center of your house where it has easy access to uh, all of the areas in your house you should be able to uh, you know uh, consume the bandwidth uh, with 4G speeds without any issues uh, I've been using this router personally for quite some while and it works great 
you can really enjoy some good download and upload speeds so yeah the router has now restarted and uh, just to kind of show you you know we should now be seeing the geo test network over here so i'm going to connect it to geo test and uh, because i've already connected to this network before the password is already saved and uh, that's it you're good to go so just one more thing if you want to be uh, using your mobile device uh, as a hotspot and if you are connecting that to the router you would need to make some settings uh, in your phone depending on whether you are using android or iphone so once you have the settings you can use it